Hi folks, it's Max from GalaxyNote2.com. Um, so I've got, I've been actually using Liquid Smooth for a while. Uh, one of the biggest problems for me, I love Liquid Smooth. Um, Korean language wasn't working. Every other language worked, but Korean language didn't work. Uh, so it's kind of a deal breaker because I check out Korean sites often uh, as I can read Korean. Anyway, um, so I did move on to the Android 4.2.2 of Rootbox. And it, um, it was it was great. It was solid. Uh, I loved it. Uh, but it was missing tethering and portable hotspot, uh, Wi-Fi tethering, and it wasn't working either. So um, <laughs> I finally moved on to Paranoid Android. Uh, it is very solid, um, very solid on Android 4.2.2. Now Paranoid Android isn't available. The uh, the Android 4.2.2 isn't available for all the uh, Galaxy Note 2s. Uh, but this one is pretty solid. This is the one I tested for the AT&T Galaxy Note 2. Uh, you can also install this on the GTN 7105 International one, uh, GTN 7105, and also T-Mobile. It's compatible with those. Um, so I highly recommend it if you're looking for a good, stable 4.2.2 ROM with Wi-Fi tether working. You know, of course, you get the extra stuff uh, which Paranoid Android comes with. Um, such as hybrid properties, you can get uh, paranoid Android colors, which kind of uh, changes colors per app basis, and also you can get tablet UI. Um, you know, paranoid Android is king of tablet UI and uh, phablet UI, and also uh, per app basis. If you want to, you know, run apps in uh, tablet mode or phone mode, you can go here and change it. Uh, let me show you my browser here. Um, so it is in kind of a tablet mode. So if you go to like a site like Engadget, everything's a little bit smaller. But I kind of like it because of the Galaxy Note's uh, bigger screen. This kind of makes does make sense. I'm kind of like falling in love with Paranoid Android again. Um, anyway, if you have an AT&T T-Mobile or uh, International GTN 7105 looking for a good Android 4.2.2 ROM, check out this version of Paranoid Android. Um, I really like it. I think I finally found a ROM that works pretty good for me. And also I've got LMT Launcher. Paranoid Android does come with uh, its own uh, Pi controls, but I've got this one um, since I can, you know, customize all my apps shortcuts, kind of more useful. Um, so I did that. You can also check that out uh, if you haven't yet. Uh, but look, looking pretty good. Um, so, you, you know, I really like this. This is a very good stable build. Now I am missing some cool features from AOKP ROM control. Um, so that's something I might, you know, work on. And uh, maybe I might install um, Jelly Bam, which is kind of a mix of Paranoid Android and all this other stuff. Uh, but this this version, you know, I like it because also the camera, I was having problems with some of the other versions. This one camera is just flawless. I've had zero problems. Uh, very good camera everything working so um, if you're looking for good Android 4.2.2 ROM for the AT&T T-Mobile uh, or the GTN 7105 try this build out every build is different but this is definitely a good one um, so check it out and sorry if you don't have an AT&T version oops I should have got back to him um, anyway check it out um, for your AT&T T-Mobile or GTN7105. And as always, if you have a Galaxy Note 2, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, uh, galaxynote2root.com. We update you once a week with ROM week tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button here, subscribe button down there. And actually, this is my daily driving ROM. Um, that's why I kind of do an extra post here, extra video. But I really like this ROM. Just check it out uh, if you have it. And uh, of course, you will not, you'll not get any multi-window features and any of that stuff. Um, you know, but it's for stability and you know better performance, better battery life. This ROM is rocking pretty good. Paranoid Android uh, for your AT&T. Oh, and I forgot to show you some of the features. Um, I mean, it's not completely featureless. Uh, if you go to, let's see, no, not advanced toolbars here. Um, you can customize your tiles. You know the 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 tiles there. You can add more tiles, um, you know, change it easily here. And uh, let me see, network mode. Um, that's not too, yeah, you can kind of change it to 2G, 3G, uh, 3G plus 2G uh, if you want. 
and uh, check it out. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. I'll see you guys later. Stay high on Android, and uh, I'm gonna keep testing more ROMs. Yo.